Since 2004, Idaho's governors, Kemp Thorne, Rish, and Otter, have proclaimed a day in October, Lights on After School Day. Hundreds of Idaho's after school programs have invited thousands in their communities and joined millions across the nation to celebrate those programs that keep our kids safe, learning, and active after the school day. But long before and long after the celebrations occur, it takes dedicated volunteers, staff, and community leaders coming together to make sure these programs are possible. It can be a thankless job, but the Idaho Out of School Network decided it shouldn't be. In 2015, the network began asking Idahoans to nominate someone in their community that goes above and beyond to ensure out of school programs are thriving. So let us introduce to you some amazing people that have been nominated by their community as our 2015 and 2016 Lights on After School Champions. From Coeur d'Alene, Dick Swartz. Dick Schwartz was our obvious choice for our Lights On After School Champion. For over a decade now, I believe, he has volunteered as a Boy Scout leader in our after school program. We couldn't be more grateful or proud to have him with us. Thank you, Dick. From Boise, Mayor Dave Beter. So when you look at what the mayor has, has championed when it comes to out-of-school programming, we have added more than a dozen different new locations where kids can find safe, affordable, and accessible after-school programming. All of those libraries, all of our after-school, uh, school-based after-school community centers, we're really working towards using our after-school component to make uh, Boise the most livable city in the country. From Mountain Home, Mr. Bill. Even now, after he's retired and he still comes to chaperone and drive the bus for trips, he tells us jokes or funny stories and is around to listen when we need to talk. So because of this, we would like to honor you, Mr. Bill, as our after school champion. Well, this award really humbles me. Um, I spent 18 years of my life in this youth center trying to make it a better place for kids. I got to see a whole generation of kids go through and uh, when they started bringing their children back to meet Grandpa Bill, I thought it was time to, to move on and let somebody else, somebody else have a shot at this. But uh, I've always tried to stay engaged in the youth center because I know how valuable the program is here. I, I really appreciate this. I don't know who started this, but uh, it's a great honor for me. Thank you very much. From Meridian, Mayor Tammy. Really, the Meridian Club would not be here were it not for Tammy DeVere. She was a leader during the campaign to get the club started. Most recently, she was our co-chair for our capital campaign that helped us expand. She's chaired our auction for three years, three of our most successful years. Um, but beyond that, she's engaged, she's involved, she loves kids, she loves her community, and I can't think of anybody more deserving than Tammy DeVere. Andrea Eimers from Grangeville. I absolutely love working with Kendra. Um, we have worked together the last 17 years um, in the consortium of after school programs as well as at the Kids Club, and she just provides invaluable guidance and support to our programs. And she's the type of person that you gravitate towards. She's just the type of person that you want to be with. From Hayden, Idaho, Nick Madsen. Anyone who's met Nick Madsen knows why he was chosen as our Lights On After School champion. He brings a passion of science and wonderment and exploration like none other.
from Eagle, Idaho, Cindy Halley. So Cindy's been a friend, of, a close friend. She's been a colleague for 11 years, but she's been a close friend for over five now. I nominated Cindy because when she opened the library in 2007, so for the past 11 years, she took the library from the students loving books and reading quietly to this high energy maker space. People walk in and they kind of wonder what is going on in here because it doesn't look like a typical library or even classroom. There's kids everywhere, there's noise, and there's things going on. So it's amazing seeing them, one, loving reading, and then two, having that high energy learning. It wouldn't be the same school without her. And last but not least, our youngest champion from Twin Falls, Sammy Fulmer. She's, she's an exemplary girl, and so she really, really deserved to be nominated because of the way I've seen her shine with, with our team and the way she works with the kids. She inspired me to, to uh, step up and, and help my son out along with the other kids in the, in the program. Yeah, she's just an awesome, an awesome leader, awesome mentor and coach. Mm -hmm. Thanks to Governor Otter, October 26th has already been proclaimed as Lights On After School Day. Do you have a champion? Nominate them today at IdahoOutOfSchool.org.